A Valley man will spend the next 10 years behind bars for a crime that stunned the country. Nathan Sutherland pleading guilty to raping an incapacitated woman at Hacienda Healthcare in Phoenix more than three years ago. Fox 10's Brian Webb was in the courtroom for his sentencing and joins us live tonight with more. Brian. Well, the judge heard testimonials from Sutherland's sister and mother-in-law, along with stories about his rough childhood and more recently time helping other inmates study the Bible. But in the end, she gave him 10 years in prison, minus more than 1,000 days of time served. I, I didn't realize I was capable of such evil, disturbing act. Nathan Sutherland hoped to gain sympathy from the judge. Born in Haiti, he says he was neglected by his mother, sexually assaulted at an orphanage, and that the bitterness and hatred led to depression and drugs as an adult. Thus caused me to eventually to react inappropriately to my pain, torment, and therefore commit that evil act. The 29-year-old victim in this case was in the Hacienda facility since 1992 after nearly drowning as a child. No one knew she was pregnant until she began giving birth to a baby boy. Her family did not speak in court or to the media outside. Sutherland, shackled in court, did speak for more than 10 minutes, but only briefly apologizing to the victim and her family. To the victim, I'm sorry. You didn't deserve to be hurt, no matter what was going on in my personal life and the demons I was, I was fighting. I had no rights to put you through that. No words can express how painfully sorry I am. I am sincerely sorry. Sutherland will be on probation for life and will have to register as a sex offender. By the way, the child he fathered will be three years old later this month. Live downtown, I'm Brian Webb, Fox 10 News.